Flip back and forth to show. Yeah, I will definitely. I'm pretty keen to see the comparison. Alright. The start of this game is so epic. So if I hit F1, it looks like that. This is what it used to look like. Best game. They put a lot of work into this back in 95. I smell asphalt, I think of Marine. Oh, even the sound is up there. That's the last sensation I had before I blacked out. Hey, the thick smell of asphalt. And the first thing I saw when I woke up was her face. She said she'd fix my bike. Free. No strings attached. I should have known then that things are never that simple. Hey, you could. Yeah. When I think of Marine, I think of two things. Quick and point, yeah. Point asphalt point. and trouble. It's so well Rip done. Rip Burger, you're dumber than dirt. Oh, Mr. Corley, if you'd only listen to my plan, my vision. I know your plan, Rip Burger. You're waiting for me to die so you can take over my company. Well, oh, sir. <laughs> That's horrible. I am not waiting for you to die. You know I've never liked you, Rip. But you have business know-how and killer instincts that I respect. Hey, Packy. Thank you, sir. But this latest Pay idea of yours. Riding up to our shareholders meeting with a gang of bikers? Who do you think you're fooling? The shareholders, sir. It's good PR to be seen hobnobbing with real Corley Motors customers. What do you know about our customers, Adrian? You've never even been on a bike. Well, you know I'd be on one right now, sir, if it weren't for my destabilizing inner ear condition. Ah, your ears are fine. It's what's between them that scares me. Hey, Packy and Kenji. I love the start of this game. We'll flick back to now retro mode. Some boys I can ride. That's what it used to look like. Step on. Let's find out who they are. Childhood, yeah, man. <laughs> Flip back. Oh, the HD mode looks pretty nice. It does. I love the pixel art, though. Pixel art never. I don't know, I feel like it's timeless, eh? Hey. Yeah, the audio difference, yeah, big time. Big time. It almost makes me think maybe they like just lowered the audio quality for the retro mode, but I know they didn't. Yeah, you can switch. Yeah, it's pretty cool. We're going to do that quite a bit throughout the game to see what games look like. Yeah, hey, Nick. HD's crisp, yeah. Who next hack have an intro like this? Yeah, right. <sighs> hey, Ben. Mm. You know, Ben, we're broke. Yeah. And if some cash doesn't come our way soon, we're in big trouble. Relax. I have a feeling something's coming our way. Something big. <laughs> they got hover cars, man. Yeah, hey, you Rip. better stay out here, Rip. This place is hey, bikers only. <laughs> All 
All right. Who's the guy that drove over my car? What could possibly be taking so long? Maybe old man Corley got himself in trouble. Yeah, maybe they took the old guy out back and worked him over with a two-by-four. Hmm, an appealing notion, but <laughs> improbable. More likely he's boring them to death with some tale of the glory days. <laughs> but Malcolm, isn't that illegal? Not back then it wasn't. <laughs> so who do you ride with these days? He rides with me. Although I'm sure he'd much rather be riding with your little club. I told you to wait out in the limo, Rip Burger. I thought you might like some help with your sales pitch, sir. Sales pitch? Yes. We have come here today to offer you and your men employment. Mr. Corley requires an escort to the annual Corley Motors shareholders meeting. Does this look like an escort service to you? You would be well compensated for your time, of course. Not interested. It's uh, fairly obvious that you could use the money. Listen, I said we're not for rent. The polecats are not goons for hire. Not even if it were Malcolm Corley's dying wish? Rip Burger! That oh, brains I'm gonna... Really? Hold that on actually... there, Malcolm. If you don't mind, I'd like to step outside with Mr. Rip Burger for a little chat. Excellent idea. <laughs> and the doctor says he only has a few months to live. That's bad news for all of us. He's not just a nice guy. He's also the last motorcycle maker in the country. What happens to Corley Motors if he dies? Don't worry. I have a plan. And if you come to the shareholders meeting with us, you'll find out what it is. No dice, Rip Burger. The Polecats are not thugs for rent. Hey, Aggie. If you want to buy muscle, you should go find the Rotwheelers. The old man says it's the Polecats are nothing. Then I guess it'll have to be nothing. Hmm. And that's your last word? That's it. Well, I'd like to make you just one final offer. <sighs> Bolus, take this coat and go get his motorcycle. We'll have to tie up this little 200-pound loose end. <laughs> it will need to look like an accident. That stuffed shirt actually thinks I'll leave him in control of Corley Motors when I go. Boy, is he in for a surprise. Hey, where's Ben going? Your colleague has decided to accept our generous offer after all. As a matter of fact, he's gone on ahead to scout out the route. He did? Well then, let's roll them, boys. Yahoo! Poor Bill, here we come. How are you, Aggie? Oh, it actually shows you this before you... Oh, what's this? Oh, I don't have one of those hooked up. It's funny that they show you an actual PS4 control, unless this was on PS4 as well. Maybe that's a thing. So if I hit A. Nope, don't hear any commentary. <laughs> First time, no, 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 no. I've played this many times before, but I haven't played the remaster before. I can't see any use for those. I'm not putting my lips on that. They're empty. No. <laughs> Apparently, I think there's a lot of Easter eggs in this game. If you do the right actions on the right things. But it's not... It's no key, right? Yeah. Some joker took my keys. I don't like that. So, can I? Good thing Rip Burger didn't touch my bike. Good I, thing for him. Can I kiss it? I'm not putting my lips on that. 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 Some joker took my keys. Ah, I tried. <laughs> I'm not putting my lips on that. Open up. I think you have to Open kick up. it, don't you? You kick it. Crap! Open up. Kick. 
And in we go. I uh, fixed your door. It was <laughs> sticky. This is what well, the place I don't want no trouble. looks like. Just leave me out of this mess. In the original. So they actually extend the graphics to fill in the gaps. That's very close, hey? Yeah, that is really nice. Can you lick the door? I'm not putting my lips on that. <laughs> it's hard enough to play with your fingers. <laughs> Man, I wish they had a jukebox. Yeah, right. Play. The monitor doesn't have any controls. I punch it. The monitor doesn't have any controls. Register. Can we actually go behind? No way. Nothing to grab. It's empty. I'm not putting my lips on that. Kiss Looks him. like you're out of customers. <laughs> yeah, your gang talk off with those those well dressed gentlemen. RTX so on and off. Whatever head off to. Where'd everybody head off to? What am I, the cruise director? Maybe they're up on the Lido deck. <laughs> I think you're in on this whole bum deal. Yeah, well, what are you going to do about it? Sorry, I'm just making room on my desk. Oops. Let's keep talking. What do you have? I want to know who knocked me out. Maybe you just passed out. You should yeah, learn the to bar. handle your liquor. All right, let's do it. You know what might look better on your nose? What? The bar. <clears throat> now don't mess around with me. All right, all right. I got your keys, but I don't know nothing. They had guns. <laughs> they told me to store you as long as possible. Why? I don't know. I don't know. I overheard them say something about an ambush up the road. What else? Nothing, nothing. Knock nah, here. Look, man. Here are your keys, all right? How's the volume, guys? Uh, to me, it feels even a little bit quiet, but I don't want it oh, drowning uh, me out. Someone did say something about killing you and making it look like an accident. They didn't do too good of a job there. But why ambush the pole, Gant? They swim? I'd better get moving. Oh. What was that? Is that... What is, what is this thing flashing up here? Touch quiet, but all we can turn it up. You're like, hey, Skeletron, no worries, man. All right, what else can he uh, tell me? I've got nothing to say. Thank you. No. <laughs> hmm. No. Uh -huh. yeah, it should be better now. Let me know if it's not. Um, I think we're good to go, right? Or how do I get into my inventory? I can't. Is it the? It just works. Excellent. These sounds aren't remastered. This is the original. No, it's not. It's slightly different. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> when I'm on the road, I'm indestructible. You see the after song? Ah, oh, so good, yeah. No one can stop me. I also played a dream intro, but a, a, a um, 331 E Rock version of it. Hey, ain't you the A number one polecat honcho? Yeah, and you're in my way. Well, get used to it, bud. When the rock wheelers hit the road, we own it. Look, I'm serious. Someone's ambushing the polecats. Someone's ambushing the polecats? Someone's ambushing <laughs> the polecats? Oh, heavens, whatever will we do? <laughs> <laughs> you like not to isn't it? Come on, kitty. Let's get down. You can't win. Oh, you can win this. Well. Have it. Oh, that's why you have to win it in this happens.
Yo, Packy thinks the bits. The fork is like to make you just something about like killing you and making it look like an accident. Something about killing you and making it look like an accident. I have a plan. They had guns. Malcolm Cole is dying. Something about an ambush up the road. I have a plan. Oh. God, this is good for a 95 game, hey? Man, this is gruesome. My editor better print these in color. Now I have to get you some help, I suppose. Oh. Ah, quit moaning. I know someone around here who can fix anything. What are you? I'm a mechanic, and apparently a pretty good doctor as well. My name's Maureen. My name's Ben. Why did you hit me over the head, Maureen? You were in an accident. A reporter found you and brought you and your bike here. My bike? What have you done with my bike? Brought it back from the dead. Sort of like what I did with you. Need a little help getting it finished, though. <sighs> Who are you? Maureen, remember? If that's too hard, maybe you should just stick with Mo. The music sounds, I don't know, it gives me Diablo 2 vibes. Full squinting? Yeah, that's what he's like. Do you have a last name? I prefer not to use it. What about you? Same deal. Then it's <laughs> Ben and Mo forever, I guess. This an authorized Corley Service Center? Now you could call this a Corley Service Center, but I don't have the official paperwork. Ah, an illegitimate Corley operation. I prefer to think of it as a renegade Corley operation. Hey, um, Riku, I'm going to do Diablo 4 when it launches. I'm going to do a solo, hardcore playthrough. Blind. Hardcore. <laughs> Where'd you learn bikes? I grew up working on them with my dad. One summer we did nothing but restore this old hardtail together. I mean, we scrubbed every bolt until it shined. But he took off one day and he never came back. So I switched to toasters. You live in this town? Well, Melonweed's not much of a town. What's left of it is sinking about a foot a year. People either learn to adjust or they leave, which is fine with me. Not a people person? I'm just better with toasters, that's all. You seem more concerned with me than your bike. Um, yeah, Canon Air, I played this way, I think around the same time, all the time. How's it look? It looks better than it did, but you gotta help me out. The front forks are wasted, so you'll have to get some new ones. And someone stole my welding torch. Can you believe that? I can't finish without one. And last but not least, I patched up your ruptured gas tank, but you're out of fuel and I don't have any. Also, this would look like this. I love how they fill in the sides that you can't see on the old game. Um, I gotta get out of this town, fast. Trouble with the law? Not in this county. Then what's the hurry? My gang's in trouble. The polecats? How'd you know that? They gamble them on the back of your jacket. They're headed for an ambush, so I gotta catch them. We better get this bad boy back on the road then, huh? Um, I don't have any money to pay you with. Hey, this one's free. I haven't touched anything besides a toaster for so long. <laughs> Getting my hands on your hog has really been a pleasure. Well, thanks. Don't sweat it. Where am I supposed to find all this stuff? You can hack it, tough guy. Hey, Patty. Uh, okay. Where am I going to find new forks? Well, they don't have to be new, new. Just not broken into little pieces. You could start by asking Todd <laughs> in the trailer across the way. He runs the junkyard. How am I supposed to find your torch? I don't know. Set up a dragnet. Still can't believe someone would steal my torch. Who around here would do a thing like that? Hey, Conan? Where's the gas? Well, there's yes. a whole tower full of it at the edge of town. I have this crazy, irrational intuition that tells me maybe it's worth checking out. Actually, I think I can handle it. Good. Well, I'll let you get back to work. Let me know if you need any aspirin or anything. 
So we can pick this up. Who's this? Oh, that's me and my Uncle Pete. He took care of me after Dad split at this place he called the Mink Ranch. And when he died, he left it to me. You're a mink farmer? Nah, that place went belly up long before he died. But I still go back there whenever I need to get away for a while. It sounds like, um... It sounded like Undertale music. <laughs> I'm not putting my lips on that. But you loved your bike. Love your bike. I'm not putting my <laughs> lips on that. <gasps> oh, good. You're not dead yet. Um, I might still get a quote. Epicurus thinks of the bits. I heard you saved my life. Yeah, but don't worry. I wasn't trying to. I was just looking for some nice roadside disaster photos and you helped. Who'd want a picture of me bleeding? It's not the blood. It's the way you were, all <laughs> twisted up like a pretzel. Sounds like Fran out of the nanny. Listen, I've got to stop an ambush. Ambush? Really? Where? Somewhere between here and Corville. My crew is escorting some VIPs to the Corley Motors shareholders meeting. And there's an ambush waiting for them somewhere up the road. Also. It looks identical, eh? Very good. Um, I... I... Yeah? This is hard for me. I... I need... Come on, man. Spit it out! Could you give me a ride in your car? I've got to stop this ambush. You're right. We have to get to the ambush, all right. But I'm afraid I'm without wheels at the moment. How did you get us here? Hitched. Well, I'd better be going. All right, drive safe now. Uh, I don't think there's anything around Nyar. I, I just keep my lips on everything. I'm not putting my lips on that. It's empty. Okay. Thanks for the lift. Now I got a quote for you. <laughs> All right, I think this is the first place to go from memory. Yeah, she had a car. West. Oh, Billy, Billy West? Who's Billy West? Isn't there something to do with this? Chim Oh no, I remember how to do this. Smells like burning metal down there. So we want to go on the door and we want to knock. Who's out there? Hey! I'm trying to do my art in here, buddy. I don't got time to waste on bums like you. Boom! All right, kiss him. <laughs> I'm not putting my lips on that. Yeah. His decor has a strong carnival coin toss flavor to it. Um, isn't there a fridge in here or something? Oh, hang on, that's a lockpick thing. Yeah. Do I go downstairs? Oh, I just clicked that. Yeah, right. I Wait, hope Paul's he's not trying to bring these to life or anything like that. That's, that's, oh wait, hang on. If we click that, <gasps> no, 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 no. If I grab the torch, I think he immediately leaves and goes back from memory. Hey, lab rat. Hey, tech. A lockpick thing. Yeah. I want to look at the art. <laughs> I had a dog with a funnel on its head when I was a kid. <laughs> Ouch. I nominate that as. Least offensive of show. 
This is radio. That would make a good mailbox post, and I'd rather just get out of here. <laughs> Not a bad version, really. I'm not putting my lips on that. Can't get up there. All right, let's grab the torch. Hey, <laughs> nitroplasm. Yeah, I knew it. That's my welding torch. How'd you get it? Oh, it was just lying around. A pair of forks, little gas, and we're set. I always thought forks back in the day was like cutlery. The thing is, there's meant to be meat in a fridge somewhere. So I think it's back in here. Oh, refrigerator. I'm blind. Because we're going to need this when we go to the junkyard. Oh, yeah. Oh, no, I need a lock first. I'm pretty sure. How do I get my inventory? Oh, there. Is this how you do it? I don't think so. Don't I need like a... A lockpick won't help there. Well, because I'm pretty sure you can't climb this without a lock. So maybe I have to go to the gas tower. Yeah, and as soon as you want to go over here... <laughs> I love that they animated that. So I think we're gonna go up here. There's nothing else, is there? I think it's just that. Aha! Uh -huh. So, grab our lockpick. Hey, it's stacky. And then grab the lock. I'm pretty sure if we go here, they are alerted, aren't they? As soon as you touch this. Just for reference, that's the OG game. That's what it used to look like. Yo, Alundra, thanks for the five months. Really? Yeah, this is a classic. This is 1995, this game. This is the remaster, though. So now we can go over here, and you can see him running, or you can just double click to like skip ahead. All right, so what we want to do is we want to open. No, wait, 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 wait. I think we want to put the lock pick. Oh, sorry, the lock. I think we want to put it on this, don't we? And then that lets you climb up and over. Yeah. Yeah. You want to play SNES? I played both. This is like Mission Impossible. Ah, uh, junk. There's that pooch. This game. Look like this. Alright, down we go. Oh, that's the wrong way. <laughs> it's ours. Bam! Busted knees. Alright, so we wanna... I think we just wanna put it in this car? Uh-oh! <laughs> yeah, right. Down. That one ill-tempered mongrel. <laughs> Alright, let's try again. Uh, life over here? Yeah, you know. Surviving. <laughs> Badminton. <laughs> here, poochie pooch. Pooch. Oh, cool, it worked. 
Bon appetit, so it's in that car. All right, well, that seems like the easy one. Uh, so then we click up here and we go into the crane. Game keeps going all pixelated. Huh. Alright, so to move this, I think I can use the arrow key. No? Maybe I have to click this. Uh, I'm not very good at this. There we go, and then we want to lower it. And then we press this. And then we want to raise it. <laughs> and then just to make it more enjoyable, the dog, we're going to move it into the middle. And we're good. <laughs> you monster. I can't skip this, but I have to wait for it. And crush the dog. Uh, what am I actually trying to do here? Uh, junk. Maybe there's like not actually anything. I think I have to go. Not up there, maybe it's somewhere else. Crap, I can't remember where the forks are. Parts pile? It must be there. Just the kind of forks I need, right on top. Uh, <clears throat> nice forks. <laughs> Where'd you find them? Right next to the knives and spoons. Hey. Just gotta gas her up and go. All right. Uh, so. How do we do this again? So, all right. Uh, not much I can do here. I think it's something to do with going over there. Hmm. Oh, here goes. I think you have to just click up the back and he walks there. Oh wow, there's a lot more detail in those guys. Oh, it's MIDI as well. I don't see nobody. He must have run away. Yeah, <laughs> we would have seen him running from the air. He must be hiding up in the tower. We got him treed. Let's go up and get him. All right. This is where I actually get to put my lips on something. Yeah, right, Chris. <laughs> um. I don't touch anything. A gas can won't help here. I'm not putting my lips on that. Crap, how do I do it? Thing without wheels. Where's the, uh, oh, there. Crap, 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 crap. Do I have time? Oh crap, I don't have the hose! I'm not putting my lips on that. I'm missing a very important piece of equipment. Where the hell's the hose? Is it back here? You need, you need a hose. Oh, right there. That was never a feature. Holding shift, yeah. So it's like a hint system. 
Okay. So anyway, where were we? Oh, I have to... A hose won't help here. Yes, it will. A gas can won't... <laughs> Alright, so now... Hose? I'm not putting my lips on that. Oops. No, I didn't mean to pick it up again! You're an idiot! Oh, jeez, I'm the worst gas thief ever. Hey, who's that down there in the yard? It's him. Get him. Where? Over there. <clears throat> Quick. You go around the other side like and we'll have him cornered. Where'd he go? Let's call it quits, huh, boss? No. Let's call on reinforcements. Suck it down. Good. You get this from the gas tower? Not exactly. Well, that's <laughs> it. Wait outside for a minute and I'll finish her up. I'm working on a surprise. I hate surprises. All right, here she comes. Am I cool or what? You're amazing. I should crash thing that in thing it? every day. So what's the surprise? Oh, just your average everyday pre-regulation destroyer class solid fuel recoil booster. You're serious? Yes. But only the vultures. I have my connections. Now, are you going to try this thing out or not? Ooh, I wish I had a camera. I wish I had some way of paying you back. Just beat it, will ya? You're scaring away my regular customers. <laughs> Bye, Mo. Send me a postcard from the ambush. Um, no, Zemex, I've never played in anything else from LucasArts. Oh, like in their book game. This is the only one I've played. <laughs> Put your lips on that. for comparison. All like right, island look lively. He's a sneaky one. This time he ain't getting past us. See him? No. Nope. Keep looking. I th think... Hang on. I'm pretty sure... And then you can click on there. I think I'm meant to go there to the place and trigger the alarm again for the gu so the guys go over there. The ambush is the other way. Yeah, I need to go here. We need to touch this. Yeah. Hear that? He's back at the gas tower. He's got a lot of nerve, that piece of trash. <clears throat> Let's get him. All units, follow me. Yeah, sweet. The best ever. I know I've heard a lot about Monkey Island. Ben, how'd you get behind us? Where are the suits? Corley's making a pit stop. He has a bladder the size of a thimble, man. <laughs> Rip Burger. Haven't seen him in a while. Ben, man, what's the deal? Did you find something up the road? Are we headed for trouble? No. We're in it. Put my head in a basket Cause I'd had a tank full When she blew my gasket I surely was thankful Till I head for the skies up above <laughs> It's a woman with wheels that I love <laughs> Come on, old man. I gotcha. Now, do something incriminating, like ambush somebody. Aha, the plot thickens.
You shouldn't have laughed at me in those board meetings, Malcolm. What a psycho. Gotcha. You worked hey, on this? Like on the remaster? What I found in the bushes. What is that? It's a chokehold. Come here and I'll demonstrate. It's got a camera. I'll get her. No. Nestor will take care of her. You have an important engagement with the rest of the Corley family. Right. You redrew but the don't photograph? To destroy what? that camera. Yeah. Dude, that's yeah. sick. Now Did you do anything else in the game? How about one for the road? Corley? Corley. Ben! <coughs> I guess Rip Burger couldn't wait for natural causes. Just like him to hit a man when his flies down. <laughs> <laughs> Rip Burger did this to you? Yeah, he knew I was dying, Feelings? and he knew that my will would put him out of a job. He wants to take over Corley Motors, Ben. Sell it off to foreigners, lay off workers, start making minivans. You understand me? Minivans! <laughs> oh. <coughs> Forgot all about the... You gotta hurt him for me, Ben. Promise me you'll hurt him bad. I promise. <coughs> I want my daughter to take over the company. You have a daughter? Yeah. And she's a real mechanical genius, Ben. Rebuilt her first carburetor when she was four. Eh, I used to call her the diaper dynamo. <coughs> Find my daughter, Ben. Find Maureen. Maureen? Burger's way ahead of me. I just hope Maureen can handle herself until I get there. Haven't seen the cutscenes in years. Gun, I understand. Dude, I grew up on this game. This is one of my favorites. Camera. Who does this guy work for? Corley Motors. But yeah, I've been holding off playing this. Nestor, what's that moving Remastered. over there by that pile? I don't know, Rip, but I think that pile is bolus. <laughs> Minivan. Uh, yes. Now I remember. You're the smart one, aren't you? There's Moe's shack, but I don't see the limo. Maybe I'd be I'm Moody Fan. <laughs> on second thought, maybe I didn't. Um oh she took the photo. Is there anything here? There is nothing in here. Looks like someone searched this place in a hurry. Nothing left but debris, except for that smashed up camera. Back's open. No film inside. Hmm. Mo said she didn't have a camera. Here's Mo's picture oh, of her and Uncle is. Pete at his mink ranch. She said she went there whenever she needed to get away for a while. That's pretty much my only lead right now. Uh, anything else worth checking? Oh, that's a whole thing you can click on, All right? I don't think anything changed here, did it? So how many people worked on it then? It's empty. Like, is it Jesus or Jesus? How many people worked on it? If you only did like a few scenes here and there, there must be heaps of people doing this. So then we want to go back this way, right? But then the cops are there or something. Yeah. Oh, that's pretty good. So much for returning to the scene of the crime. Actually, be coming this way soon. You can see a square over the actual fast. thing where they've drawn it in. It's like a different... There's like a box around it. Stop getting off your bike, damn it! You need to go this way. You don't have much gas, you're wasting all your gas. Oh, really? That's really interesting. Oh, yes.
I got it. I got it. Ben, no time to talk. You know, it's stank in there, but I can't remember a better sleep. You <laughs> gotta help me. Go find my editor in Corville. Tell him I took pictures of the Corley murder. You got pictures? Yeah, but some thug took my camera. So you don't have any pictures? Well, I tracked the guy to Melonweed, but I'm not going near the place. They kill me. Get my editor. He's got to get me out of this. Take one of these fake IDs to get through the roadblocks. <laughs> My career is riding on those pictures. Help me, Ben. You're my only hope. Oh, don't worry. That is definitely a Star one. Wars reference. If Miranda's thug is the same one that trashed Moe's place, that could be Miranda's camera I saw there. But then, <laughs> who's got the film? <laughs> a new hope. Achievement unlocked. A new hope. Yeah, that's good. <laughs> Hey, killer. What? Hey, it's cool. Your secret's safe with me. What secret? Haven't you been watching the news? Once again, our top story tonight. Malcolm Corley, owner of Corley Motors, was found dead at a rest stop just outside the town of Melonweed. Wait, did... Apparently, the He's Mark Hamill in patriarch this. and CEO was viciously beaten about the head and neck, savagely and without mercy. Police have arrested a notorious outlaw biker gang known as the Polecats. No. With the exception of their leader, who is still at large. Roadblocks have been set up along Highway 9 in an effort to apprehend this dangerous and violent criminal. We've been set up. Roadblocks suck. <laughs> I shouldn't have left the gang there. Hey, I don't want to hear anything about it. You want to make me an accessory after the fact? Just lay low, man. Ah, oh, you know, I remember reading about that a long time ago. That just sparked my memory. Yeah. Now I'm going to pay way more attention. All right, guys, how do I do the knife game? How do I actually get to play it? What's the trick? I can do that. I can do that. Not going to happen. Not going to happen. Let me show you how to do that. Not going to happen. Let me show you how to do that. Not gonna happen. Let me show you how to do that. Not gonna happen. It's just luck, isn't Let me it? show you how to do that. Not gonna happen. Let me show you how to do that. Not gonna happen. Let me show you how to do that. Not gonna happen. Let me show you how to do that. Not gonna happen. Let me show you how to do that. Not gonna happen. Let me show you how to do that. Only if it'll shut you up. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Do you think I can do it? You're pathetic. Damn. Oh! <laughs> oh yeah, you sure are good at that, buddy. You're pathetic. Ah, <laughs> <gasps> oh, so good. <laughs> Let me try that again. Only if it'll shut you up. Hmm. <laughs> Ouch. Here, but Ouch. <laughs> You're pathetic. <gasps> Seem to have a lot of time on your hands. Not to mention nicks and scratches. <laughs> Am I distracting you? <laughs> That's your truck out front. 
I need a ride. I look like a cabbie to you. Get lost. They're not letting anyone through that roadblock anyway. Not even truckers? They turned me around, said police business only, pigs. The face, yeah. Look, I really need a ride. Not gonna happen. Why? Because you're afraid of some cops? No, because I don't like you. <laughs> I just killed a guy. I'm just about to. <laughs> I think that's good for the table. Hey, Quahog. <laughs> yeah, Emmett? I'm gonna be knifing up your table for a while, all right? The customer with the knife is always right. <laughs> good talking to you. Friendly folks you get in here. Damn, it's not what you'd call an I'm okay, you're okay person. Ah, shut your home, Quahog. <laughs> it's good, eh, yeah? Look, let me tell you what happened. I told you, I don't want to get involved. Look, let me tell you what happened. I told you, I don't want to get involved. Anything else in here? Oh god, there's so much stuff you can look at. The monitor doesn't have any controls. Oh, are they all the, the same? The monitor doesn't have any controls. What's this? It's a big blobby gray shape. <laughs> it's taken an art class. That's one big fish. Yep. Are you the guy with the lampshade on his head? Or the guy chugging out of the punch bowl? Lampshade. <laughs> this your pit bull? Nah, that's my baby picture. <laughs> Whoa. Watch it, that's my sister. <laughs> <laughs> the monitor doesn't have any controls. There's one here I haven't looked at. Fifteen guys with towels in their belts? My graduating class from bartending school. <laughs> What's that? The monitor doesn't have any controls. What's that? Ah, booze. Can't. Gotta ride. I'm not putting my lips on that. All right. Do I fight him? He's got a knife. So? He's got a knife. So? Good talking to you. Uh. He doesn't look happy. All right, I think I have to go back outside. <laughs> Can I put my mouth on there? Yeah. This sucker's mine. Look, I really need a ride. Look, I really need a ride. Look, I really need a ride. What else do you do? Hang on. Oh, the IDs! The IDs! The IDs! I forgot about that. Here. The polka on top of the piano? Fake federal investigator ID could oh. be of some use in one of those roadblocks. No, I did not. Ever hear of this place, Uncle Pete's Mink Ranch? I remember there used to be some sort of weasel plantation or, or something up the road. Down Highway 9 on the other side of them damn roadblocks. I used to pick up mink meat there real cheap and sell it to school lunch programs. <laughs> that was a good scam. So how about a ride? What if they search the back and find my bike? It's buried in a pile of concentrated fertilizer powder. You hold the record for this Oh, really? No one's gonna dig Dude, through that nice. crap. Now you're gonna ride in the engine compartment. The engine compartment? Hey, I smuggle stuff in there all the time, and most of it's worth more than you. So stuff your carcass in there quick, and we might hit that mink dump by morning. Hope you're better with a stick shift than you are with a knife. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> The goal of the game? Get back my pole cats. Oh great. Smells like he's got a fuel leak. I love engine fires. <laughs> Yo, Hylian. Sorry, sir. Only police vehicles beyond this point. I'm with the fans. Jump and check it out. Huh? 
What's this about? <laughs> Undercover agricultural sting operation. What's in the back? Fertilizer. All right, move along. Hope you rude get your man. <laughs> <laughs> Steal something from the bike, doesn't he like the booster or something? They stopped moving. Problem with your truck? Yeah, <laughs> loose holes, uh, nothing big. Uh, I, I already pulled your bike out. It's sitting right over there. Well, nice knowing you. Gotta hit the road, you know. fuel leak and he took my fuel line to fix it that trucker is gonna uh. die for what he did so can't you read it from here oh yeah by the way this looks like this the barn's locked all right in we go so I don't have anything I don't have anything oh I don't even have my lockpick I don't have anything Oh boy, what is this? Looks like a mink pelt. That's the insignia of the vultures. I can't believe Mo used to be a vulture. But then again, how else could she have gotten that recoil booster? <laughs> I got some photos to look at. There's a picture of Maureen and Malcolm. Looks like they're restoring an old hardtail together. Lots of bikes. Lots of bikes. Lots of bikes. <laughs> Lots of bikes. Very well then. Oh, underneath the pillow, I think. Yeah, tire iron. Can I use the tire iron on this? Hell yeah. <laughs> Lots of bikes. Junk and a hose I can use on my bike. I don't think Mo would mind if I borrow him. Mo? That's right. Oh, she stole the booster, I think. Booster fuel. Ah. Why is she running from me? She must think the whole world's against her. I think I know how that feels. <laughs> that does it. He's dead. That sign. That means I'm in cavefish territory. <laughs> Those are the cool ones. This music reminds me of um, Am I Evil? This cargo is worthless. 
Yo, have Kama, thanks for the 20 months. Brothers. Back to the cave. Music is good, man. Hmm. The place looks deserted. Maybe the boss was wrong and she ain't coming here. She's coming. We just got here first. That means all we have to do is sit here and wait. Alright, I don't know if there's anything I can do right this second, is there? Oh no, there is. I've, I'm trying to screw him up. Apparently it is arrows, yeah. Eat the fertilizer. Can you do that? Um... I'm not putting my lips on that. I got an achievement for that. <laughs> Maybe I'll just take a little. I actually took some? Oh! Oh, hang on! That's very important for one of the fights, I think. Isn't it? I'm no cowboy. Alright, so anyway, I think I have to do something like this. I might need a bit of help getting into the cavefish cave because I can't really remember. Well, that's all of them. Can't be much holding that up now. I think I just want to push it. All over the bike. What a mess. All right, and back on we go. Which way do I want to go? Is it this way? It's been a long time since I played it as well. Oh, this is where I can control it. Do I want to take the X? The mink range. Oh. The pixel switch just shows you what the game <laughs> looked like in 95. Look at him run. So it used to look like this. And this is the, the redraw. A zombie. Zambi. I think we're just staying on here. And then kicking this into their faces. Ah! See you, Fink. Boss, it was Nestor's fault. Get in quick. <laughs> I have a plan. We're going to lure the quarry women out of hiding with a bike. Boss, she already has a bike. Yes, but this one she worked on with her father. It's an emotional thing. Don't try to understand. Now hurry. Something tells me the bridge is out. <laughs> really? X bridge? Something tells me the bridge is out. I'm not putting my lips on that. Hmm. No. Not on foot. Not not on foot. I don't think there's anything else here, is there? Oh, you can actually look at the gorge. Wow. Wow. That's his own. Not on foot. Impression. No. Hmm. No. <laughs> Hmm. 
Broken sword? No, I don't even know that one. Oh, what? One of the gorge's many casualties. <laughs> Ricky Myron's infamous gorge jump. Professor Schmetterling's experimental flying suit. <laughs> this is the last picture ever taken of Professor Schmetterling. <laughs> so dark. Yo, Sebastian. Thanks for the three months. Notice. Jumping the Poyahoga Gorge, although tempting, is highly illegal and dangerous. We recommend the recently constructed Poyahoga Gorge Bridge for transgorge travel. Drive safely. Oh, it's a butterfly. <laughs> right. Tightrope walkers, hang gliders, human cannonballs. Many have tried to cross the mighty Poyahoga Gorge, and many have failed. Except for Ricky Myron, the Flying Torch who jumped the gorge on a stock Corley motorcycle. It was later uncovered that he had modified his Corley with a pre-regulation destroyer-class solid fuel recoil booster and an automotive hover lift. Myron said he would gladly replicate the jump to clear his name, but his special ramp was stolen by a mysterious truck hijacking motorcycle gang. Hmm. Recoil booster and a hover lift, eh? Thanks for the tip, Rick. You're right, though. I'll need that ramp. <laughs> I've missed this game. Alright, so this is the part where I'm gonna be a little bit lost. So you get into fights. Oh, this looks way different. This is what it used to look like. All like pre-rendered stuff. Find what a torque. torque. I haven't seen you since you retired from the Polecats. Hey, Ben. How's my gang doing? Uh, that's a long story. What are you doing out here? Well, retirement's pretty boring, Ben. So I thought I'd come out to the old mine road and look for trouble. You're picking fights? That's what the old mine road's for, son. Father Tork, I need your help. The gang's in jail and the law. Ben, I'm not the leader of the Polecats anymore. You are. Can't you see I'm on permanent vacation? Any fighting tips, Tork? Ah, oh, Ben, who's tougher than you? <laughs> Nobody, but those rod wheelers are uglier. They're none too bright either. I'm sure you can handle them. The vultures are quick, and they're nuts. The ones with those boosters are hard to whip. Just remember, Ben, it's not about muscle, it's about timing. Okay, gotta whip those ones. Whip the booster guys. What's up with those cave fish, man? Watch out, Ben. They're not out here for sport. They hijack big rigs. It's part of their religion. Don't get in their way. They're blind, cold-hearted killers. How do the cavefish ride if they're blind? Well, they're only blind because they wear those special goggles to shield their sensitive cave-dwelling eyes. <laughs> special sensors in the goggles pick up the dots in the road and other large objects and landmarks to help them navigate. <laughs> kind of trippy, huh? Yo, Zambi, thanks for the prime sub. I feel like, is it the, do I use the, the toxic stuff that I've picked up to throw it into the cave fish's face? Is that what I'm, the, the, is that what I'm meant to do? You know any way around Boyahoga Gorge? Around it? <laughs> it's miles and miles long, man. What's the matter? Don't like bridges? It blew up. Ooh, sorry I missed that. Well, you could jump it, like Ricky Myron. Cape Fish got his ramp in their hideout, you know. Where is the Cape Fish hideout exactly? Somewhere on this road. The entrance is totally invisible. Maybe thumb. Those weird Cape Fish specs. Can't talk anymore, Ben. Eating too many bugs. Well, take it easy, Father. Give him hell, Polecat. All right. 
Ooh, it's a Rottweiler, I think. So I just need to fight this guy, right? That's all I do. Oh, I use a tire iron. Yeah. Please don't let me lose the fight. No, I suck at this fight, man. And it like cycles through them, so you're always in like the same fights, I think. Like, so. Oh, no, it's taking me back to this guy. No, this is a different dude, isn't it? Eat this. No! No! I wasted it! No, I didn't! No! I. Well. So I still have it then? I still have that stuff? I don't have to pick up more? Alright, good. Oh, now this... I can't get close to this guy, I'm pretty sure. This is going great. The guy with the. Aggressive little boy. Is there a strat for this? Brute <laughs> force. Destroyer class solid fuel recoil booster you have there. Why, yes, it is. Ta da! Oh. <coughs> so I have to find that guy again. Hit them and don't get hit. I always wondered what if you got hit by a car right there, you know? How many exhausts do you need on your bike? More. Clearly. Maybe I need to sit, like, get further away and use the chain. I, uh, yeah, I didn't check actually. I'm pretty sure I do. Oh, yeah, I do. Now I'm. <laughs> Eat this, Charlie. I hate bull. Freaky punk. I could have. You're gonna die. Did I just lose my chain? Now I'm mad. I just lost my chain. What the hell? You can do that? I didn't know you could lose your weapon. Who's with it says something wrong? Shouldn't hit a man wearing glasses. <laughs> <laughs> nice. So how do I do this? What is the goal here? How do I do that? Don't I have to throw the goo in their face?
You need distance. Oh, I got my chain back. Oh, it's like killed the guy with the chain. Hey, it's my <laughs> oh, oh. Now I got the plank of wood. No? I've already got that, do I? If you take an exit, you just go back onto the main road. Okay, so maybe I'm not allowed to touch him. You never seen this game? This is the this is the part of the game that's very difficult for me. Oh right, we this guy. Oh, the chick? You're like chopper. Oh huh? the chainsaw, that's right. <laughs> oh yeah. I could have used that. Attack, damn it! Yeah! Yeah! Just for that, I'm taking that arm off! Yeah! What is going on here? Um, pans and things for the five months. You drop anchor or something? Sorry. Gotta How run. do I do it? <laughs> I never understood this part. I just do not know what to do. Am I meant to use that stuff there? Does anyone know? They raise their head going on cracks. Oh. I hate this guy, man. How am I supposed to get that? Chainsaw? Back again. Good. Okay, lesson's over. Time for the final exam. <laughs> no! <sighs> Need the board for the goggles. The cave fish goggles. Anchor or something? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what do I use the fertilizer on? The fertilizer on the plank guy. Really? Oh, it's a chainsaw. Fertilizer on the plank guy. Whip on this dude. What's wrong? Yes! Lead divers. 
in Actually, here. A couple of good boosts left in it. All right, that's one major thing. So this guy was the fertilizer. Is there a trick to it? Back for more? You're firewood. Oh yeah! Let's chop you down and catch a ring! Yeah! Not do it. Oh, he's got the gold. I don't have the the mace. So isn't this the guy? This is the guy with the board. Chainsaw doesn't have goggles. Oh, what? Hang on. The guy with the... Oh, the, oh am I meant to throw that into her face? Because she doesn't have goggles. So how do I deal with these guys? He doesn't have goggles either. Oh. I see. What's this guy got? He's got goggles, so I'll just chain him. Oh, that's the guy I beat before, yeah. I need that, I need that weapon. God, I need that weapon! Is this the chainsaw chick? No, but she doesn't have... Who is this? I haven't seen her. Wow, are you <clears throat> Fist or feet? So I need a, I need a board to do this? Do I? Is the story? Can't reach. Can't reach. <laughs> what is this guy? Is this the guy with the the mace? Back again. Good. Time for the final exam. He's got goggles on though. I can't. I can't use the fertilizer on him. So this is gonna be Back for more. Let's chop you down yes. and have a Excellent. I don't think kicking the cave fish is gonna work. I'm chains are in this bitch. Bring it. Well, 
good for that. Nothing. Cannon fodder. Surely the chainsaw can be used on this guy as well. Oh, OP. Yes! Alright, show me a cave fish. Alright, so I think it's wood, right? Does he look up and then I do it? Ah! Yeah, I'm not following Omeo. Thanks for the seven months. All right, so we want to equip the goggles, and then we find the cave fish entrance. Game used to look like this. Use the board to build a bridge. Pretty sure it shows up like yellow. <laughs> Packy, I don't know if you um, were around, but I did do a full Duke Nukem playthrough this year. No, it's on it's down here. No cave. The caves are in here somewhere. I missed it. What? <laughs> I was looking at chat and man. Crap. It beeped five times. Death, I wasn't, I thought it was just a normal exit like that. Oh well. <sighs> We're doing a lap. <laughs> exactly, Master Tank. Yeah, we're set. It was yellow on the screen, right? When it happened. Oi, JR. You nerd. <laughs> Copen. Dude, Jay, thanks for the five gift subs. Did you know we are 136 away from another remote slot? Don't tell me I missed it again. No! 
No! <laughs> Jaya! <laughs> My God, dude! <laughs> Can I take my gift stuff back? <gasps> Shit! Oh, it's hex. That's on the top of the screen then. Shut up, Tech. This is very important. Don't pull a JR and distract me. Exit. paying attention this time. Oh, okay, we're going over the thing. Thanks for this, JR. Yeah. Lower left says enter cave. Yeah. I'm good at paying attention to, the, to details. See? I did it. Third prize of charm. <laughs> hey, you've been on this thing for the six months. Alright, let's go. This music. Alright, I need this ramp. Oh, the cavefish are so used to coming in here that when you move it, they go and crash, I'm pretty sure. Good. Is there anything else in here I need to look at? No. I haven't attached this, have I? There we go. Kind of polynomial, yeah. Now I'm pretty sure... Is this where we drop the ramp? Yeah, <laughs> that's right. done with these boys it throws the goggles away property of the Ricky Myron traveling stunt show let's do it <laughs> it's all right I've got one of those mouthful rocket boosted things. Okay, you can get on the bike already. I got everything except for that auto hover lift. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. No, I haven't played it so.
I'm... <laughs> Get back on the bike. <laughs> I already forgot. There we go. Just leave a car out in the middle of nowhere. I don't touch anything without wheels. <laughs> That's the hover thing, right? <laughs> oh, hang on. Looks okay for an aftermarket part. Or is that the hover? Here we go. No, wait, what? Oh, I have to actually click it. All right, I've modified my bike. This part's cool. Let's do it. Song here is so cool. Yeah, yeah. Jump off the ramp. Call him murder. See, if you see, I play heaps of different stuff lately. Heaps. Let's have a look at the sign here. Corley Motors. I've been meaning to come here for years. This is really a religious pilgrimage for me. A religious pilgrimage with a lot of butt kicking. Of course I am. True master. Just like the cell doors in solitary. The jank destruction do Oh, I remember a bit of that. I'm here for the shareholders' meeting. Mr. Ripperger has postponed the meeting until Mr. Corley's murderers are apprehended. All the shareholders were notified. Yeah. Well, I haven't checked my voicemail lately, Mac. <laughs> I'm going to go down here. Souvenirs here. This guy. Oh, pants. the bunny. We got your pennants. We got it all right here. Official Corley Motors merchandise. <clears throat> what can I get you? Why are all the lights down here? We got a demolition derby tonight. First prize is a vintage Corley hardtail. Another toxic compilation? Nah. restored by the old man himself. Yep. What's this big arena doing way out here? Corley built the Smashatorium so his employees could have some wholesome entertainment nearby. He sure took care of his employees. I got no idea what's gonna happen to us now that he's gone. 
I'm looking for a good souvenir. Well, good souvenirs is all I got. What can I fix you up with? What do I need for this? I need the car, I don't know. How about that little car there? It's small, but it's not cheap, my friend. You better just take it for a test drive to make sure. Bunnies, and plenty of them. You want bunnies? I got your bunnies. How much you got on you? Uh, can I just take them out for a <laughs> test drive? I think you may not be ready for the kind of commitment that comes with a Corley Bunny value pack. Sorry, <laughs> son. Those uh, shirts come in extra, extra large. Eh. Eh, no, but they're pretty shrunk. No, thanks. What do those pennants say on them? Can't beat a Corley, they say. Kind of ironic, Can't actually. Can't beat a Corley? Died. <laughs> Still, look great on your bedroom wall. No walls. My bike is my home. We could set you up with a little pole so you could uh, make a flag, you know, for your back seat. I'll, uh, think about it. <laughs> Actually, let me think about it. He who hesitates goes home with Jack, and his kids hate him. Thanks for the warning. Seen any vultures around here? Nah, we don't have much of a vulture problem here, even though their hideout <laughs> is right up the road. <laughs> yeah. They stay pretty much locked up in there. Not very social. Uh. What's in the hat? I don't know. Came filled with it. Probably some sort of packing material. Packs a punch, I'll tell you that much. Uh, hmm. Better let you get back to work. All right, matey. Drive your own derby car by remote control. Our bunnies come with batteries included. Sure, sure. Take it for a spin. Just don't go out of range. Lovable, lovable little bunnies. The officially licensed bunny of the Corley Motors Smashatorium. We well, you got your t-shirts here. All sizes and colors. Looks like it's getting weak. Oh, great. You killed the batteries. Fill our handy beverage hats with your drink of choice. <sighs> How do I deal with this? It's out of juice. Uh, you, big fella. Come give our derby car a spin. Souvenirs to remind you of your special... That's what having a regular job will do to you. <laughs> Buy your kids a bunny so they'll... That wouldn't help things. I got a button under my toe that's wired directly into Corley Security's alarm system. Of course, I could be lying, but the question is... Do you feel lucky? <laughs> Lately, no. <laughs> Excuse me, but are those shirts, uh... Are they all cotton? Well, uh... Let's just see here. One hundred percent cotton. Oh, um, that's too bad. I'm allergic to cotton. <laughs> Don't be a cheap jerk. Buy something. Excuse me, but are those uh -oh. shirts, uh, are they all cotton? Well, uh, let's just see here. So, I, how do I, what do I, I need to get batteries from somewhere, don't I? Oh, wrong button. Don't press that. It's out of juice. 100% cotton. Yep. Oh, that's the button to skip. Alright. Those weapons were out of weight. You just can't get this stuff anywhere else, folks. And it's cheap, too. What's down here? So this is where you need to drive the remote control car. That's the old hardtail Mo restored with Malcolm. It's the exit. It only spins one way, and it's the wrong way. Uh. I'm practically giving this loot away. What's a couple of bucks in exchange for a timeless memento? These souvenirs all have an expected appreciation rate of 300% per year. Uh, all right, I think I need to like suss out that other area first, maybe. <laughs> yeah, I, the, it's, I think it might be a Twitch thing. Or maybe, no, I think I dropped some frames. That might be it. So 
so this is where the mine... I think I have to do this before I can do the next part. There's the vultures hideout. On the other side of this field, I've heard a lot about the vultures. And I guess it's all true. So then we grab our bunny friend. I think. <laughs> You're a little bunny. <laughs> I love how it leaves a little trail in the dirt, too. Uh, hey, there's the batteries. Alright. Now I can replace the batteries in the remote control car. Carissimo, there's a lot more bunnies where that one came from. Don't crowd everybody, there's enough for everyone. That should put some life into it. Alright, now we can drive that again. Sure, sure, take it for a spin. Just don't go out of range. Okay, click on that, yeah. Okay, that's far enough, bud. Let's bring her back now. Do I click on that to go in there? Yeah. Hey, don't go in there. Now look what you did. The entrance is all the way through the factory. Hang on, little buddy. Daddy's coming. <laughs> now it's just me and the bunnies. Twelve pack of bunnies. The bunnies. Um, was it 2017 or 2016? The remake. The Energizer Bunny ads? Yeah, we did. Wait, Energizer Bunny. Wait, wait, wait. Did I miss a joke in the game? <laughs> the minefield's been replanted. Tidy little vultures. Alright, well, here we go. Good luck, buddies. <laughs> oh, wait. I was meant to do one at a time, wasn't I? Or is this right? I don't know. Oh, maybe it's okay. The music? Yeah, it's epic music for an epic moment. think so. Mm -hmm. No. Mm -hmm. No. I don't think I did it right. I don't want to set off any of these boys. I don't want to set off any of these boys. Yeah, I don't think I did it right. Don't think so. Damn it. I think... Dang, 
There goes another one. Now you're back. I, I, I remember, like, you have to pick him back up or something. Or do I need to grab another box of them? Do I need another box? My idea is right. The second box or to pick up all the bunnies. Don't think so. Because I think if you don't send them in a single file, they blow up the other one. So you gotta do it one at a time. So that was not 12, was it? Okay. Why did that other one catch up so quick? He caught up so quick. Hope I haven't screwed it up. Stands slightly to the left. No, I want to make sure they keep going in the same direction. They don't create more paths. Dude. I don't want to set off any of these boys. That's way too smart. Come on, buddy. You can do it. Uh-oh. Maybe not. Oh, yes! <laughs> that's the guy I was telling you about, Susie. You sure? Yeah. That's the guy who killed my father. All right, vultures. Rack them up. Let's rip them quick. Listen, Mo. You're making a big mistake. Oh, well, you're not. We shouldn't do this quickly. We should draw this out, don't you think, Susie? Hey, I got all night. You heard her, kids. Let's draw this out. Draw. <laughs> Your father. Don't you dare talk about my father, you heartless bastard. Corley and I. I said shut up about my dad. Malcolm once. I said shut up about my dad. I'm losing my temper, Maureen. And you're about to lose much more. Okay, that's enough. Mm, not quite. <clears throat> I'm innocent. You're in something, all right. Let me go, or else... Or else what? Uh... 
I'll get blood all over your driveway. I'll get blood all over your driveway. That's good for the landscaping, actually. Let me go, or else... Or else what? I'll call, call your names. <laughs> like what? Diaper Dynamo. Diaper Dynamo. How did you hear that name? Your father. He told me just before he died. You bludgeoned my father and then talked about old times? I didn't kill him. Rip Burger did. A photographer took pictures, but her camera was stolen by the same thug that came after you. I... I still have that role. Well, develop it, would you? While I still fit in my clothes? Okay, you stay here. Hey. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, well, don't sweat it. I'm gonna get Rip Burger even if I die trying. No, we have to expose Rip Burger at the shareholders' meeting. That way, we take him down, we save my gang, and your father gets his dying wish. You take over Corley Motors. Rip Burger canceled the shareholders' meeting. He made a statement to the press that there'd be no meeting until the murderers were brought to justice. So. No shareholders meeting until we're both dead? Hmm. That could be arranged. Okay, so here we go. Faking Ben and Maureen's death. Act one, scene one. Adrian Ripburger, in a desperate attempt to lure our Maureen out of hiding, has developed the following lame-ass scheme. First prize at tonight's smash-up derby is a vintage hardtail that Mo restored with her dad. Rip hopes Mo will try to nab said bike on account of her sentimental attachment to it. So Ben and Mo play along, put on disguises, and enter the demolition derby, which ends tragically when their cars explode and both are presumed dead. Uh, question. Please save your questions until the end. Oh, she's now, from the Simpsons. The explosives in Mo's car can only be triggered by a head on collision with Ben's car. This ejector seat projects Mo clear of the explosion, and she parachutes to safety. So like, Don't you see Mo or notice her rejecting out of her car? No, they'll all yeah. be watching you running around on fire. Yeah, that's another question I have. When your car explodes, you climb from it in flames and run around the stadium distracting the audience. In your cute little asbestos suit, of course. <laughs> that's some plan. All right then. Let's go blow you little darlings up! All right, folks. Hang on to your chili dogs, cause it's time to start. The Corley Motors Smashatorium Amateur Driver Ultimate Destruction Maximum Carnage Marathon. Let's meet our crash cage gladiators. That mysterious looking hooded mm -hmm. figure wouldn't give us his real name. He prefers to be known as the Unknown Avenger. And just fine with us, isn't it, folks? <laughs> now I'm just embarrassed for them. Who do they think they're fooling with those ludicrous disguises? And next to him is another mass newcomer. Please give a big smashatorium salute to the princess of Pile-Up, Dory Smorley. And finally, we have a last-minute addition to the lineup tonight, a deadly-looking team known as the Boom Boom Brothers. Mm -hmm. All right now, are you ready to see some reckless driving? Are you ready to see some unnecessarily violent destruction? Then let the demolition derby begin. I vaguely remember this. Are you Ben? Hang on, Mo. Here I come. So I can do that again. Okay, real this is really weird. The control! So you turn you move the mouse left to turn right. Oh, I'm gonna use the jump bomb. Watch out for the Boom Boom Brothers, Mo. Oh, this is so awkward. Man, what are you doing? Get over.
over here and nail me. I'm trying. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> Up the ramp! Oh, this is so impossible to control! That car stalled when I bounced off the roof. Looks like these babies have a glass jaw. Does that mean that I want to now win, or...? No. Or, do it now I go over the other one? No. How the hell do I do it? I can't avoid these other cars forever. I, I, dude, this thing is impossible to control with a mouse. Oh my god. Can I like, oh, you can use the arrow keys on the keyboard? Oh, well. Alright, what else is happening here? Something I need to know about this thing. How do I? How do I? Am I meant to be able to boost or something? Do I have to push this thing all the way over? No, no! What is this garbage? Let me up the bloody ramp, dude. This is impossible! I think this is what you do. You know what? I have a feeling I'm meant to push it off that ramp. Alright, over 
we got. Okay, Boom Boom Brothers. It works. It's all over. Get him! What are you doing? Are you taking a nap? <sighs> Idiots. Okay, Mo. Time for our big finale. Do it! Now that's an explosion, ladies and gentlemen. Can't see any survivors. Wait, what's that? It's hmm. the unknown Avenger, and he's on fire! Let's give him a hand, folks. That looks painful. We really should put him out right away, but what a show, huh? I guess the Avenger never heard of stop, drop, and roll, huh? <laughs> What am I meant to do? <gasps> what a pain threshold. <laughs> this is your moment to shine. What's meant for that? I'm saving. Still no sign of Miss Morley. What? Well, we should put him out. Don't you think? Well, okay, you heard of Avenger. Oh, am I meant to be going? Out, but I can't get through that door. Get through the door. What? I'm not putting my lips on that. Oh, am I missing boxy? Oh. 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 Okay, we have to run across the back. that firefly while he's hot. <laughs> Look at him run. Oh, I can actually do something here. I think I'm meant to be jumping on top of this. I did the right thing. What happened? Did you get him? We finally got him, Bolas. That means Ripburger has to make us vice presidents now, like he promised, and give us 10,000 shares of stock each. Hmm. Funny smell. What's that? The temperature light? Well, on the bright side, I just made 20,000 shares of stock. <laughs> Time to start the shareholders meeting. So that's... Um... Where's the hard tail? All over the floor, Mr. Avenger. What? Oh, what happened to your deep already. sentimental attachment to your father's vintage bike? Ben, it's just a bike. I can put a bet together in about a half an hour. That's assuming, of course, I can find that key. <laughs> Dude, um, uh, what's his name that does the voice of Rip Burger? Uh, oh, I'm too tired. I've forgotten. Crap.
What key are yes, you talking Lord about? Hammer. Key to my dad's safe. I remember he hid it somewhere on this bike, but I've looked everywhere and I can't find it anything pink that in the brain, even yeah. looks like a key. What's in the safe that's so important? My dad's will. I'm counting on him to tell the truth about me, finally. Why did he keep you a secret all these years? He didn't want people to find out about my mom. What's so bad about Mrs. Corley? She wasn't my mom. Huh. But how are we going to get in the factory? In the back of the factory, there's See, a reindeer? secret entrance that leads straight into Dad's office. He used to sneak me in so I could help him with his bike designs. When he got too old to do all the work himself? Nah, this is back when I was six. Hmm. How do I find the secret passage? Well, it's tricky. You have to wait for all the utility meters to turn black. Then you kick the wall in just the right spot and you're in. How do I find the right spot to kick? Dad just knew exactly where to kick it. But I remember that there was this big crack in the wall. And if I line up that crack with my eye level and kick the wall right in front of me, this weird portal would open up. Hmm. What if I can't find that spot? Just line up your eyes with the crack, wait for the meters to go black, and kick. <laughs> that kicking part is pretty vague. Look. I was only six. Give me a break. Hey, Skid. I'll never find that secret passage. Hey, Ben, can't you see I'm busy? If I could find the spot to kick when I was only six, I'm sure you can find it on your own. How was your flight? Well, there were some explosions during takeoff, and I landed in a minefield. But other than that, it was fine. I'm fine, by the way. Thanks for asking. Uh-huh. Great, now help me find that key. What are we in, anyway? It's a C-330 Big Mouth Industrial Cargo Jumbo Transport we fixed up. We want to get it rolling so we can take it to biker rallies. You're going to try to fly this thing? Rolling, Ben. Rolling. <laughs> this baby's flying days are over, just like mine. Remember that time you tried to kill me? <laughs> yeah, we really taught you a lesson. <laughs> get it? Wait. Taught? What? Hey, Brian. I'll see what I can do. Right. Uh, anything in here? Oh, these are codes for something, aren't they? I am pretty sure those are codes. All right. 15, 44, 9, 2, 48, 05, 3. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, hello. 897 67 I've also got this one. Hmm. 1247-8 Hmm. B Six seven T nine three. Here, take the photos. I don't want them. Show them to someone important if you get a chance. <laughs> Uh... We look at the sign. Cool. <laughs> cool. The Corley Motors factory. Holy ground. Let's do it. These need more exposure than that. Oh. Sorry, the meeting's already started. I know. Let me in. Mr. Ripperger's giving his keynote address. No interruptions. But I'm a shareholder. Yeah, right. Jerk. Okay. It's meant for nuts. What?
something about kicking a wall or something? Mr. Ripperger is giving his keynote address. No interruptions. But I'm a shareholder. Back yeah, entrance. Right. Wait, but how do you get the back entrance? Jerk. Oh, there's a thing there. No! <laughs> back in there. <laughs> What's this? It's sealed shut. It's closed. So when all those align, then you kick the wall or something, right? Or something? These must be the meters Mo was talking about. I think this is the wall right here. What am I doing wrong? Or is that the thing that I kicked? The green slime. That's the giveaway. Yes! <laughs> This is emulated. No, this is on um, Steam. Oh, I do not remember any of this. Oh, forty four. It what? There's uh, some sort of card. A tape. I sure hope that's Corley's will. It's open. I know. Furniture moving? No. Did you five? Six? Look at that stadium burn. That's gonna take a bite out of the pension fund. That's art. Alright, well, away we go. I'm pretty sure we got that, right? Yeah, that's the film thing. Um, hello? Card reader. Cool. And we have to edit the film, though. I remember this. Looks like the meeting started. Was not only an inspirational leader, but also a great personal friend. His loss oh. affects us all. Boy, Stace. Malcolm and I spoke often of the future. We talked of a day when Corley Motors would move beyond its humble beginnings into a new vehicular age. And although his tragic death took him from us sooner than anyone expected, Malcolm Corley's dream remains. And I shall carry out that dream in his memory. Ladies and gentlemen, I am pleased to present to you the future of Corley Motors. The Corley Miniman. <laughs> Minivans. Uh, Corley was right. I never dreamed it would actually come to minivans, though. So, there's two levers. I don't think. What the? Uh... What the hell is going on up there? I'm on it. Just readjusting the lamp and motor controls here. Uh, uh, yes. As I was saying... I hate this old equipment. My girdle needs less adjusting. <laughs> Alright, uh, we need to go back in. How do I, how do, I do this? 
somehow I have to put film on this. I don't think that plays real to real tapes. <laughs> what if I just pull this? It's locked. Ay, ay, ay. This is intolerable. I'm on it. Just a lamp adjustment. Be fixed in no time. Uh, yeah, yes. Hmm. Sorry about that. Shut up, brain. <laughs> Man, that oh. can yap. Where does he get this crap? Hey, who are you? How long have you been there? Oh, security. Help! Security! Oh, no. What took you so long? He ran down the hallway. Move it. Mavis must be seeing things. <laughs> cool. Alright, no. We need to go. What's this? It's locked. Okay. Check out that double chin. What a stuffed shirt. Ah! Hell! What? Security! <sighs> it was Nico, thanks guy, for the 37 the months. One. Catch him this time, will ya? This is gonna get old fast. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's not in here. I've done, like, everything in here, right? Or am I meant to do this? <laughs> it's locked. No. Not again. Not again. <laughs> Just readjusting the lamp and motor controls here. Uh. Mm. Uh, yes. Now then. Seems to not be the answer though. Jeez, my feet are killing me. When's this thing gonna end? <laughs> this is intolerable. It's locked. The other side of this. What you see before you oh, I did it. now is my vision for the Oh, perfect. This is a disaster. You're telling me. We're gonna have some major downtime here. Why don't you tell a joke or something? <laughs> uh, I, I don't know any jokes. <laughs> you know, this reminds me of an amusing anecdote <laughs> about a. Uh, uh, I... <laughs> well, I'm out of ideas. Well, Mavis, get it together. No, I'm not really sure of that. Now, this next slide shows our new, more aggressive corporate strategy. <laughs> Hello there. If you're hearing this, I must have croaked. <laughs> Well, people got to move on, you know, and make room for other people. And that's what I'm here to talk about today. I've made room for someone else to take my place at Corley Motors. And it ain't that embezzling crook, Adrian Ripper. Rip, you don't belong at the head of my company. You belong in jail. Uh... I let that man talk me into far too many things. Hey, Frag. Like keeping my daughter a secret. He was wrong. I was wrong. I should have stood by her. I hope, Maureen, that you forgive me. 
and that you take over Corley Motors and run it however you see fit. All right, that's enough. How do I turn this damn thing off? I... Uh, I'm sorry you had to hear that tape from one of Malcolm's psychiatric sessions. And near the end, he, he suffered many paranoid delusions. He was haunted by powerful forces of his own creation. And here's one of them. <gasps> Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Maureen Corley, and do I have a heck of a story for you. By the time I'm done, you'll see why this man should be in jail. Hey! Where do you hobble off to? Uh-oh. There he goes. And then he the sent run. his goons after me. Well, we are gonna beat this tonight. Hey, yeah. Run, Rip Burger. When it's time to find you, we'll just follow the shiny trail. Yes, of course we'll have daycare facilities. Any other questions? Oh, speak of the devil. Come over here, Ben. That was great, Ben. Finally, where we were meant to be all along. So, after we pick up your yeah, bike, that's how I run we'll too. go get my gang out of jail. And then find out why my gang never showed up to help nah, us. Nah, I know I haven't. And then you go. This is the only point in I've played. Don't remind me. Other than the last dinosaur egg, actually. You're going to be rich. At this point, I'd settle for just a little peace and quiet. Now that I think about it, the last dinosaur egg. Cool. You know what? I feel like it's something to do with this chain, right? I'm saving it. Ah. I'm saving it. Yo, my mom. I can't. I, I can't. The fans like to think meat grinder to be small. How do I? I'm saving that chain. Touched it. Oh. Hang it. What else is here? There. I can't get to that. Though. I can't reach it. Um, I'm putting my lips on that. That dance like a big meat grinder. Yeah, it is like a big meat grinder. What do I do? I, I can't, can't go in there. That dance like a big meat grinder. Ah, oh, we push his vision. Well, we did. Hmm. Let me try that again. <laughs> so, skip that. There we go. don't complain. You're going to be rich. At this point, I settled. All right. How do we do this? How do we do this? Oh, it's not good for that. I cannot remember how to do this. Dude, I can't remember how to do this. What's meant for that? 
It's like I can't do anything there. If I pull the panel up. Um, you want to do it? Oh man, I can't remember what to do. Every time you get out and shoot. I can't do anything about my flash. And we did. Um. Why do I have them so Hang on a second. Wait, wait. I think I see. Yes. You need more than a cane when I'm through with you, Ripburger. All right. So we got his cane, then we throw that into the motor. <laughs> and then we want to do something with the fuel line, don't we? See a nut anywhere I'm there. Maybe this hatch? I'd rather he didn't know I was back here. What do I do? Oh my god. I see. That didn't happen before. Yes. We're headed for the gorge. Ripburger, you're going to kill all of us. Shh, Ben, don't move. How do you stop this thing? From the cockpit. Hmm. I can't remember how to do this. Because he shoots, doesn't he? Doc! Careful, Ben! So much for the controls. I could have used those. I think I want this? Damn. Busted. That's a good thing, right? Uh, emergency. Uh, military crisis. Uh, nope. Engine failure. Uh oh. Uh, engine shut off. System has been severely damaged. Oh no, 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 no. That's not good. Uh, landing. Uh, runway landing. Uh, manual controls. No! Um, takeoff, pre takeoff, cargo, no, engine, uh, systems check. Shh, I'm dead. Wait, emergency, control loss, brake systems, emergency brakes, rear brakes, yes, no. <laughs> All right, emergency, control loss. Brake systems. Drag shoots. Full deployment. <laughs> Emergency. No. Control loss. No. Control loss. Brake system. No! <laughs> oh, let me try that again. Oops. All right, let's go back over to here. Oi, white one, thanks for 38 months. <laughs> it's 
Cajun thinks it is. Is it actually that? Hang on. What is that red button? No, nothing. Those might have been. That's trash. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Emergency, control loss, brake systems, drag chutes, detached chutes. Self-destruct. You want me to try self-destruct? Control loss. No. Engine failure. No. Military. Self-destruct. Toast. Is that actually it? Military crisis? Passenger, passenger control? Dude, how do I get out of here? How are you supposed to know? Yay. No. Let me try an edit. Not that. I did not know what to do. Oh, hang on. Wait, wait, wait. I know. Emergency? It's in, you've got to drop the cargo. Don't you? Something about the cargo? Damn it. Autopilot? <laughs> Ouch. Let me try it. <sighs> Reverse the engines? I haven't tried that yet. Oh, get off it. Get off it! I can't remember how to end. Alright, uh... How do I... Okay. Seatbelt instructions? Autopilot's not working. I don't know what to do! Okay, that's the re that's the reversing of engines. It doesn't seem to work. <gasps> Use your logic, mate. I feel like I've done all the logic. I tried spin jumping. Not yet. Okay, control loss. Wing systems. It's none of that stuff. That we don't have wings.
I just wanted to see if that did anything. Control loss. Brake systems. Drag shoots. Full deployment. I, did I already try that? Control loss. Emergency brakes. Both brakes. ABS. Come on! What is it? How are you supposed to know? I don't know. I've done partial, I've done full, I've done ditch. Drop fuel? I don't know what to do. <laughs> We're gonna be here all night? Yeah, we are. Why can the plane drive on the street? Something about the wheels? Oh, I didn't mean to press that! Am I trying to turn off the wheels? Gear? Raise gear? Nothing. Yes! <laughs> what the? What did you do? <laughs> She's faking it. He got out of the thing easy. This is what it did look like. Ben! Ben! Are you alive? I am, but I don't know about Rip Burger. I can see him. He's out cold. Climb back here quick. Careful, Ben. I'm taking you and your friends with me, Ben. All you're taking is the wrong kind of medication. <laughs> nothing, nothing, no. He'll run out of ammo eventually, won't he? Kiss him! <laughs> oh yeah, the graphics are incredible for, uh, for back then. <laughs> they still look so good. Can't reach him. I'm saving that chain for my friends on the old mine road. Uh -huh. Vehicles reported it's stolen. Uh, main menu? Oh, hello. I think that's game over. Can I die again? No. I do I'm remember the end again. of this being hard. Ben, climb back here quick. There's no time. Defense menu. Act oh, this is the machine guns. Maintenance. Damn it. Defense, machine gun. Control. System off. Yeah. <laughs> I'd beat a call. <laughs> huh. Well, it answers then. It's good. <laughs> Wait, come back. We need your weight in the plane. Yeah, oh, the bike, the bike, the bike! The bike! I did it wrong! I'm 
Oh, I have to do this again. I'm back here quick. You've got to ride out on your bike. You, you can't let your bike go down. Oh, shit. Forgot. Uh, defense, machine gun control. What if I fire it? Oh, I actually get an achievement for that. <laughs> I think you just killed a seagull. <laughs> all right, we'll skip all that. Okay, let's let's go. How poetic! You an achievement? <laughs> So, all we want to do is get on the bike. Yes. And that's it. That's the game. mystery to most of us and yet an inspiration to us all he gave us freedom he gave us power he gave us wings he gave us wheels thank you Malcolm Corley for giving us a dream that will never die You can look away really accurate. So. <laughs> so. Uh, maybe we could do lunch sometime next week. Yeah, sure. Lunch sounds great. Things aren't gonna change, are they, Ben? I mean, just because I'm in charge of the company now, and living in a mansion and riding around in limos. Have fun at work, That doesn't mean we won't spend a lot of time together, does it? Look, Mo, you're in a different league now. You shouldn't be hanging out with the likes of me anymore. But Ben, just a second. Hello? What? No, 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 that's crazy. Is he nuts? Look, move the meeting up to five and tell the plant foreman that I'm coming over personally to inspect those parts. I know, I know, that's what I told him. <sighs> Excuse me, what was that last part? No, 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 that alloy was flawed to begin with. Uh-huh, yeah, 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 good, great. Yeah, when you're playing blind, it, does, you know, it it there's a lot of figuring out you have to do. Plus, like three quarters of the playthrough is figuring out the end of the game. Oi, Carl! Thanks for the 14 months. That's it's a really good game. Hey? That was the game. Yeah, three hours. Just under three hours, actually. I'm sure there's anything after the credits, but yeah. It's not minted from tools. Is it? Surely not. <laughs> no DKC music? Uh, the next game on the list? I don't know yet, actually. Um, <laughs> oh my god. 
Alright, so Full Throttle was on my maybe list. You know, I've, this might sound really crazy, but one of the one of the next games on my list might end up being Mission Impossible on Nintendo 64. That's also on my maybe list, but I remember it being... It got a bit of a bad rap when it came out. But it's actually not that bad. It's not that bad from what I remember, but I remember it being very difficult. It is a hard game, yeah. I'll be playing on probably the easy difficulty. It's not that bad. I enjoyed it. I played the 64 one, not the PlayStation one or whatever. What? Phenomenous. Thanks, man. Thanks for five bucks. I would love a pizza. It's 9 p.m. though, and I've already had dinner. <laughs> but maybe later this week. <laughs> you are the content creator? Excuse me? <laughs> Airline fracture. Oh my goodness. Esmili, have you been Googling these? The Mission Impossible game had, like, almost nothing to do with the movie as well. I'm pretty sure, didn't it? It was very different. Oh, uh, okay. Can you see a Nick? So yeah, that's on the list. Rogue Leader, I would like to do at some point. What else appeals to me for soon? I don't know. Maybe Jazz Jackrabbit 2. Loosely based on the TV series. There's a TV series? Wait, isn't that TV series from like way before the very first movie came out? Like way back? See it, Venomous. Thanks, man. Did you miss the end? You sure did. I don't know. Um, I've got a lot of games on my list. It's just like, it's hard to pick the next one because there's so many that I'd want to do. Jurassic Park on Super Nintendo. Ocarina of Time's on my list. That'll be very, very casual. Very casual. What's the, um... There's a uh, point-and-click adventure about this, like, detective as well that was on, like, iPhone and stuff. And that was pretty, that, like, from what I played, that was actually pretty good. I can't remember what that was called, though. Uh -huh. Shadowgate? I've only played the Game Boy version of Shadowgate, and only briefly. On occasion, I've never played it in. Wood Park? No. No, there's a... Hang on, I'll find it. Hang on, one second. It was called... Kind of crude. No, none of the ones. No one's mentioned it yet. Does anyone know? It's like a detective game. You play this like really washed up cop or something. 
Hey, James. Yo, my thanks for the whole year. Dude, how is it not showing up? I would have thought for sure this would show up on um, my Google search. No, it's not Legends of Larry. Yo, Osu, thanks for 39 months. And the, 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 the normal message. You know what I'm talking about? You can't put your finger on it? Yeah, it's like, oh, you like this fat detective or whatever, and he's like really like dirty looking, and um, starts off in his apartment, you go to the street. No, it's not Texas. God, what the hell was it called? It was on an iPhone and stuff. This is going to drive me crazy. No, no. Oh my. Gosh. I can picture it and everything. I just can't. No. Someone must know it. Does anyone know a point and click game? It was on like iPhone and stuff. Wolf Mo no. Is he playing this? Oh, this is great, Maya. It's so good. Detective. I swear he was a detective. Hector! Badge of Carnage. Yes! That's what it was. Yeah, I just found it. But God, that took forever to find. Hector, fat ass of the law, is a hard nosed and soft bellied detective inspector. Violent, drunken, vulgar, with an unhealthy taste for all things criminal or corrupt. There's three episodes. Damn, that took so long to find. How was that so difficult to find? It came out in 2010. Telltale Games, it's actually a Telltale Games game. I didn't know that. Gee. Should I get on this? Oh. Are the credits really this long? I'm sad Telltale disbanded because they never finished the Walking Dead games. I haven't played the final one that came out and I, it makes me sad thinking about starting it and not finishing it. How do you not know that app-based game is also on Windows, by the way, apparently. You would be good for the stream. I reckon it'd be pretty funny, yeah. Oh, you mean Sam Hack? Sam Hack? Isn't that like a bunny or something? Wait, are these lyrics? You lost Rip Maragon. Oh, the haikus. The population is greatly decreased. And now the odds are greatly increased. Am I getting a DMC ad for this That stuff? I may someday get a chance to kiss your lips. I thank the Lord each day for the apocalypse. This is the song in the dude's, like, welding basement or whatever. I think, is it? Ah, oh, here we go, here we go.
Not the bunny music. Oh, what? This is an achievement for that? <laughs> That's awesome. That's in the original. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah, I'm not sure what the game, the next game is going to be yet. The list be long, but it's getting shorter as we keep finishing games. It's on Steam now, it's like six bucks. I've got games I want to play first though. What's this? Yeah, nice. So, what's in bonus? Concept art, audio commentaries, jukebox. Oh, that's cool. 147 of them. It's cool that they have this. That's not in the game. Oh, is that the... Hide out near the end, actually. Hmm. Thrown into the grill of the truck. Oh, really? Damn, that's a cool Easter egg. Ben Throttle. That's his last name. Throttle. <laughs> Left the dog in the car, it's still there. It's alright, I fed him first. Looks like they went through a lot of art to get him into the final phase. What's this guy's name? Some is it say somebody mean? Somebody mean. That's almost identical to what's in the game. Is that a map of the game? <laughs> Boy, that's really cool. Huh. What's this? Oh, the plane. Nesta and Bolus. That was back in 93. Meridun, are you talking about Beat Saber? Now's probably not the time. <laughs> George Lucas. Oh, in the intro at the destruction, Debbie, one of the drivers is George Lucas. Is that the guy that was on the far left? Yeah, nice. Thicken up the letters, more blockier overall. Widen the U. The T and H need some breathing space between them. Huh. 
equal spacing. <laughs> oh yeah, that's that's awesome. Seeing stuff like that. Mm, oh, that's the crane thing. It says far out. Logo ideas. like a comic book was this actually did they do a comic for this logo was it oh yeah the derby that's the merch bench I wonder what they did, like, to, did they, did they render that in 3D or something and then put it in the game or did they just, how was it originally done? Honestly, I think if they did another full throttle game though, it might have lost the magic of having just one. Like, what would a second one be about, you know? all of this stuff what was there actually a toaster in her place I never noticed that that was reversed man That's a bit different. Cool. Where is it? <laughs> Commentary. You can listen to both versions, that's cool. I don't think it's gonna have any, this is just the background music. But it doesn't have the other stuff in it. Put my head in a basket, cause I'd had a tank full. When she blow my gasket, I surely was thankful. Till I head for the skies <laughs> up above. It's a woman with wheels that I love. <laughs> All right, guys. 
It's time to go on a raid. Is there any like? What my? Oh wait, there's another page. Full throttle. That's from the very start. Does it have the... It doesn't, it's only background music. Well you made it this far. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe if you want to see more content like this.